file open up on scan to cat here and let's say that we want to convert it into a dwg file and make sure that all the scaling and the measurements are correct so um what we, what you want to do is click on file here on the upper left go down to scale options uh and there are two main options for this one now if you're working with a raster document that's been scanned and the scanner was able to record the DPI settings of the scan or even if you personally know the DPI settings of the scan you can click on um, this option right now it's uh, grayed out because we're working with a vector PDF but uh, this works for any raster PDFs um, you can click on this option and then set the DPI of the raster image sometimes if it's already recorded in the uh, PN, uh, PDF file it's going to automatically be set and then you can set the scale factor in this case um, I don't want it to scale to the size of the document because the document is an A4 uh, sized PDF and the floor plan on the image is actually 1 is a 75 I want to scale this um, drawing of the floor plan into a 1 is to 1 version as a PDF so uh, in that case we want to use manual measurement here so um, pick the measurement option click on measure here uh, you can click on snap the endpoints to make it easier also if you want to snap the um, measuring tool to the X or Y axis you can also click on orthogonal snap but uh, I personally don't want to use this feature um, for the units, it uh, depends on what units you have here. For this particular image, I believe this is millimeters. So I'm going to click on this and change the unit to millimeters. And then, now um, we know that this measurement is 6,980 uh, millimeters. So what we want to do is, uh, while uh, have, having all the right settings here, and make sure, making sure that the snap the endpoints option is uh, checked click on the endpoint uh, roughly at the area of the endpoint here then drag it over to the endpoint over here click on calibrate and now change this to 6980 click on apply that should set the um, scale of this uh, blueprint uh, as a one is to one um, measurement when you open it up on your uh, preferred CAD program after you save this as a DWG so after you've set the scale right either with this method or with the DPI method that I discussed before um, the last step is just to click on export here in the upper right click the drop down choose DWG as an option you can choose 2013 or 2018 um, name it whatever you want to name it I'm just gonna name it converted correct scale and then click on save a couple of op options here export options that you can choose and then just click on OK when you're done with that so that's basically the whole process uh, this works with any PDF um, documents and uh, drawings that you might have for raster PDFs, you might have to convert them into a vector uh, file first before saving, but the process should be basically the same. It's as simple as that.